I can't read Japanese. I've never played this game before. I just got it um, yesterday. And I just, I tested it to make sure it worked. But that was, that was literally all I did. I mean, it's a very good-looking game. Um, it doesn't really play like a Castlevania, per se, but it uses Castlevania elements. Like, this whole first level is, is the um, map from Castlevania 1, which is pretty neat. What's going on, dude? But, uh, yeah, I mean... It's a pretty cool game, from what I've seen. And you'll see lots of familiar stuff um, from Castlevania in the game. No! Throw things up, which is cool. What's going on, McKinley? I don't think this is bloody tears. And I know my bloody tears. It's probably vampire. Bloody Tears is It's like this should be familiar. All the gears and shit. That's, you know, straight out of Castlevania. I like this game though. It was a little expensive, but eh. Ah shit. Um, yeah, this will be in an upcoming pickups. I actually already filmed the pickups, and I need to edit it. I'll probably edit it and upload it tomorrow. I didn't include this on there, just because I got it yesterday, and I filmed Sunday. But it's a good episode of pickups. I got some cool stuff. And the little rotating platforms when you land on them. I don't know if you guys know, um... Yeah, I mean, it wasn't super expensive. I mean, it was like, I paid, I think, 25 bucks with free shipping. Shit! Oh, yeah, it's a lot easier than Castlevania, for sure. But, I mean, I think, I think in Japan it was, um, you know, marketed kind of towards kids. But when you see the first level boss, you'll be like, what the fuck? coming up very quickly. I like that the hearts stack up, too. Look at that fucking moon. All chill. Alright, here's the boss. <laughs> oh, Japan, never change. But that's just, like, the first part. A KKK Nazi. I can't make this up. What's up, Nico? Yep, KKK Nazi. Yeah, he has a swastika on his on his forehead. Like, I I, I just I don't get it. Like, when when in development were they like? You know, we should have a Nazi. But it shouldn't just be a Nazi. It should be a KKK Nazi. Yeah, that sounds good. I have no idea what all this shit is. I need to get a um, translation patch.
Well, the swastika means something else in Japan. What the fuck is this? One up. I see one up, so am I getting an extra life? I hope I'm getting an extra life. I didn't get an extra life. What a bunch of bullshit. So now I have, like, a charge shot. Where's that other shot, though? Aha! Uh -huh, there it is. Fucking birds. Such a happy game. I like it, though. I think it looks really good for an NES game. Or a Femicom. Characters are big and colorful, and backgrounds are a bit simplistic, but they're nice. What's up, Bear? You just missed the, the KKK Nazi. We got some platforming here. It's really not that expensive. Um, I don't know what's going on here. Ah, fuck. No, this is, this is Famicom. This is the only Famicom game I own. And it was only released for the Famicom. Hmm. That's a bit tricky. Made even trickier by Slowdown, but... Yeah, Gum and Clive is really good. Um... I never played the 3DS ones. I'm really, I really enjoyed the Wii U one. Not much, Bear. Just doing a little streamy stream. Aha, okay. You know, I, I have been thinking about picking that up. Fuck that! Come on! I totally landed on that. There's another, um... Famicom only game I, I really want. Um, Holy Diver. But it's super expensive. Um, my buddy makes repros. And I might... Ah, there we go. I might get him to repro it for me. Because it's like... It's like a... Me it, what the fuck is this? Okay. This is, this is different. Shit! Get out of here! What the hell? This is crazy! Ah! What the hell, man? Get those, get those fireballs throwing! Fucking... I don't know what that dude is! He's fucking me up! Fuck out of here. Charge shot. Bam, bitch! No, sir! Fuck you. Fucking turtles! Holy shit! What is this blast processing? <laughs> this is crazy. I hope it ends soon, though. I only got one hit point left. Okay, cool. Wow, that was that was pretty tense. That was fucking cool, though. I like that. I watched. Uh, speaking of speed runs, I watched the speed run of. Uh, Fuck that! Of, um... Castlevania 1, dude, did it in 13 minutes. That shit was insane. That time she doesn't even hit me. That's cute. Bitch. I really could use an extra life. I wish I could read Japanese. So I could see, like, what the stuff in the middle is. Oh shit, it's a giant chicken! Yeah, you didn't like that shit. Coming out of my level! Fucker. That was weird. I figured he would've hit me there. Why isn't that hitting him? That's weird. It's not hitting him, and he's not hitting me. But then, I got hit there, but I hit him. Whatever. Yeah, there was. F 
Fuck that. God damn it. Where's that charge shot? Why would I switch from that? That's what I need to be using. I wonder if there's continues in this game. I guess we're about to find out. Um... Game over? Okay, okay, hey! Awesome. A coin! That's cool. That, that, um... Oh, you fucking piece of shit. I don't, I don't know what coins do, so I don't really care about them. Stop giving me, why are you giving me coins all of a sudden? Whatever. I think I'm at the start of the level again, though. I am. Fucking Christ. KKK member and a giant chicken. I mean, you know, it's pretty, it pretty much writes itself. Fuck, that means I gotta do that crazy ass blast processing thing again. What's up, Jack? I, I might as well just die here, cause fuck, I'm just wasting all my lives. I need to pay attention. I hope I have unlimited continues. I don't know. It appears that I do. And I do keep my charge shot, which is nice. I don't understand these coins. I guess because I'm killing them with a charge shot, it's giving me a coin, but, like, I don't even... Fucker. I don't even know, like, what you do with them. What the hell? I need to slow down. Fireballs up her skirt. Gives a new meaning to fire crotch now, doesn't it? Yeah, this part again. This part sucks. Alright, so wait for it to go to the top. Look at the chat room and don't pay attention to the game. That's what you're supposed to do right there. FYI. That's that new... I like his little dance. Ah, you fucker. Oh god. I shouldn't be anyone's fetish. Except your mom's. Alright, blast processing time. Alright, let's switch to the, the three. The try shot. I love the virtual boy. It's sitting over there. On the floor, looking at me. Charge, charge. Shoot. Charge. Charge shot. These just don't even hurt you, they just try to, like, knock you off the map. Or off the, uh, thingamabobber. Oh, okay, well that hurt. Wow, that was close. Jesus! What, what hit me?! is starting me at the beginning. That's some bullshit. What? I don't know. I guess maybe I didn't trigger a checkpoint. I got 
yeah, or turtle or something. God only knows what. Yeah, fuck Konami. Those bastards. Why the hell didn't they bring this to the States? All you had to do is change KKK, man. Drop the swastika. Make him look like a ghost. And you could have had it. Kid Dracula's fucking awesome. He's a cool character. Look at his big hair. It's all white and shit. I find it odd that it, it's Kid Dracula yet. He doesn't bite people, he throws fireballs. But I guess that's akin to, like, um, Dracula in the NES games. Alright. Blast processing time. Wow! That was some serious tech shit right there. Oh yeah, I forgot I can shoot up. I'm so not used to that in a Castlevania style game. Wow. Oh, you've gotta be shitting me, dude! Well, if, if you get a Retron 5, you can get the, the import. I'm playing mine on my Retron 5. With the Super Nintendo controller. Super comfy. Yeah, that knockback's some bullshit. And that's what's fucking me. Oh well. I think I'll get it this time. And if not, I'll just try again. This game doesn't anger me for some reason. It's too cute. Wow, that kind of pissed me off, though. But that's fine, because I was on my last life. Continue! Oh, God. You know, Simon's Curse... Or, Simon's Quest. Oh, wait. Now I'm... Now I'm, now I'm just confused. Castlevania 2! Like, it's a... It's not necessarily a bad game. It's just a different game. It's a Nintendo Power game. You know, and a lot, I wouldn't say games were made for that, with that in mind, but I think a lot of um, developers took into account that kind of stuff. But I mean, really, like, trying to figure out, like, think, think about it like this. Think about playing Castlevania 2 in the era, yeah, Simon's Quest. Um, that shit confused me, though. Um, think about playing Castlevania 2 in the era with no internet. Where you, you literally are, you know, for all intents and purposes, in the dark. Think of how, but, like, yes, it had some artificial fluff because of that. But think of how long that game would last you. That one game. If pending, you didn't get tired of it. So... I don't know. Like, a lot of people fault the game for being so cryptic in areas. And I get that, but... I don't know. I mean, that's like faulting Castlevania 3 for being, you know, tough as shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, it's hard as shit, but... It also lasted you a long time. Length can be a detriment. I mean, she usually never has a problem with, um, my length, but I could see, like, I mean, they do have to get used to it, so, I, 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 I got you on that one. Oh, Jesus. That's some bullshit! Alright, slight frustration is setting in. Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, padding is never, especially in the modern age, it's it's bullshit. But I mean, games were made differently back then. That was stupid. I almost killed myself. Fuck! 
fucking bullshit! Prime Brer! You are no good son of a bitch. Worse than Michael Jordan, uh, Michael Jackson. I never liked you. I love the Iron Cheek. Virgil's grown on me, too. Like, he's a complete dumbass, but... I think he's finally to the point of self-realization that he's a complete dumbass. And he's been very funny on Twitter as of late. Okay, damn it. Let's do this shit. Go. I hate turtles. Where am I? Jesus Lord. Why? Why did that take two hits? Well, yeah, Xavier Woods hates him. Um, because allegedly he told him something like when he was 17 that he would never make it because he was a black dude trying to wrestle. Which is such a weird statement, I mean. Granted, if you're in the, the WWE, being a black champion, you know, a world heavyweight champion, isn't, you know, commonplace or anything, but there's, there's been plenty of successful black wrestlers. Uh, Virgil's just the salty motherfucker, I think. trick in this game. I don't think it'll help me, but... I love that sound. <laughs> Classic. Alright, so we've got one hit to our name. I should have I should have taken the two seconds to get that fucking heart. But, I'm not that smart. I know you saw that. I mean, jeez Louise. That's just ridiculous. The turtles, like, sandwiched me. And why the fuck will Twitter not... Hold on. Let me send out a tweet. Um... The one thing I don't like about this YouTube gaming nonsense is that, like, um, like, it, it tells you to populate a name room and all that shit, and when you do, you would think that when you send out a tweet, it would send out, you know, the name of the game and all that shit, but for some reason it always is, like, the last thing I played, like, if you were on my last stream, I played NBA Jam Tournament Edition, and whenever I try to tweet it, it tweets out playing NBA Jam Tournament Edition. It's like, no, I'm not. I'm playing Kid Dracula. Ajukojo Mojo Bojo Bojo. How do you say it? In Japanese. Yeah, those fucking turtles, dude. Fucking bullshit. Alright, so we need to get this heart piece. Or else we won't stand a chance. Well, I mean, we'll stand a chance, but... I just think it's lame that I can't get it from right here. You actually have to jump down from there. But that's okay. Good idea, McKinley. Nowadays, I'm all about just using everything to your advantage. Always. If you got save states, you save states. Fuck it. Especially at my age. I'm not quite as crisp with some of these games as I once was. Ooh, hello! Uh, okay. So that gave me an extra hit point, 
too, so I need to be getting that every time. Sean likes hacks. Hey, whatever gets the job done. Yeah, I mean, I, I like this game. I think it's pretty fucking good. It would have been... I think it would have been good. I don't know if you could have released it under the Castlevania name, but I think you could have released it as Kid Dracula, and it would have done well in the States. Big, colorful, technologically sound, cheap fucking turtles. Please. Okay, cool. Alright. Alright, we might be good here. Stay on. Alright, alright, alright. Looking good. Fucking turtles! Stay on! Okay, good. Throw shit. Stay on. Good, good. Hey, hey. Alright. Well, I'm using, I'm using the, um, the Super Nintendo controller. I don't have it all mapped out to have, like, the home button and shit. But, I mean, if I'm, if I'm playing on a live stream, I'd like to play somewhat legit. Alright, so we are in good shape going up against Chicken Fucker. Well, he's not really a chicken fucker. I guess he's just technically a chicken. Alright, you bastard. Concentration, gentlemen. <laughs> cool. All right, so they're giving me a new thing, coins that I don't know how to use. Um. All right, this is neat. Thanks, bud. Have a good night. I gotta get to bed soon as well. I'm gonna be up early for work. All right, so we chose B. Which is cool. We get more ladies dancing. Alright. Talking about a one-up that I'll never see. That's that's pretty cool. Hmm. Interesting locale. Wow! An underwater level. Never would have expected that. Oh, you fuckery! Um, okay, so you, ooh, yeah, I don't, I don't like this. <laughs> you hold the button to swim, to jump high, but you can't, like, he floats like that, and that's why I keep getting hit there, because I'm floating, and when I release the button, I would think that I would, you know, sink to the bottom, but you definitely So, like, just tapping the button does that. Okay. No, you can tap or hold it. I don't like this part at all, to be perfectly honest with you. It's not very well thought out. Totally not frustrating yet, my ass. Please be the end of the water. Okay, this is promising. Alright, back on land. I don't know what's on the other side! Okay. <laughs> this is a fucking weird level. What a fun game, though. I'll need to do a 
quick review on this one day. I'm going to start trying, basically the idea of the quick reviews um, that I did for like Alien vs. Predator, it's basically just going to be like, on a weekend I'm going to film like three quick reviews, and then I'll of course have, you know, bigger stuff, why I love retro gaming news, all that shit. But that's just going to be like supplemental content, so like if I get tied up with, you know, day job shit or real life shit or whatever, um... I can continuously have content on this channel, because, I mean, at first, this this channel was just going to be like, you know, whatever, but, um, I don't know, because of the, the success so far of it, and, you know, what I've managed to achieve with it, I kind of want to keep it going, I want to I wanna see where it can go, so, I'm going to do something like that, I totally stole that idea from 8-Bit Eric, um, yeah, pretty much. I mean, they're just, they're gonna be like three minute tops reviews. I'm just gonna talk about some of the aspects of the game, and it's gonna be, you know, should you buy it or not. But yeah, this game, this game will definitely be a buy it. And, because of this stream, I'll already have all the footage recorded. So that makes it super easy. Alright, we can't afford to get hit here. Oh, Jesus, the boss. Oh my god! This game. This game's something else. <laughs> I don't like this only one hit point shit. Ah, I knew that was gonna kill me. Come on! That's such fuckery. What is anything in this game? It's a weird ass fucking game, dude. Uh, that's part of why I like it so much so far, though. Fuck. I'm just gonna die. Suicide! Kill these fireballs. They're very detrimental to my platforming. What's going on, buddy? Yeah, it, it, it's a super fun game. Stupid! No! Oh, damn it! I see, so those things rotate, and then that indicates what direction it's going to shoot in. I think I'm just going to go for this. Yeah, this is what I need to be doing the whole time, just fucking going for it. Are you going to stack? Give me another? Oh, cheap bastard. No, you bastard! Go, go, go! Make moves! Go, go, go! Wait, Oh, fuck. Alright, here we go. Zombie U, come on. Zombie U is terribly average. Needed more melee weapons, which I heard the... Uh, <laughs> yeah, just spawn them right on top of me so that I get hit. Zombie U isn't a bad game. It's just an under... It could have been much more. I was going to say underrated, but... I really need to beat this dude because this is my last life, damn it! I know, right? It's very uncastlevania y. Damn it. That's alright. I've I've got the mechanics down for this. I need to I think switch weapons for that boss. I mean it's it's not an expensive game to own either. Like I said, I paid um I mean, I, I did eBay buy it now for like 25 bucks shipped. For a... Fuck. 
for, uh, you know, a Castlevania spinoff? That's not bad. I actually had someone on Twitter try to sell it to me for 27 with, like, 12 bucks shipping because he lived in Japan. I was like, mm, nah. <laughs> like, eBay is not the devil. You just got to know how to use it. Yeah, there's a lot of dumbasses on eBay who overpay for stuff. Yeah, okay, I'll give you the co-op, or the, the multiplayer was interesting. It, it was just an... It could have been much more Zombie U. That's, that's my beef with it. I think it, it could have been a great game, but it ended up being a mediocre game. So we're almost at the checkpoint. Oh, come on! With the fuckery. I am actually going to be, um... I've got a couple, uh, different things lined up as well. Um... Coming up soon-ish. Um, I'll be reviewing an all-new NES game that, um... I don't really know much about it, to be honest with you. Um, someone tagged me in a post on Facebook, and um, I ended up talking with a guy. And um, he was like, yeah, I make NES games. I got a new game. I got review copies. So I was like, hey, cool. Um, if you want to send me one, that'd be rad. So he's sending me one of those. Um, and I also... Um, there's a... It's a crate-style thing. Um retro games that um, I'm going to be trying out, and I figured, you know, might as well review it on the channel, so we'll see, wow, everyone left, oh no, they didn't leave, it's just my counter was messed up, it said I had two people, I was like, wow, okay, but yeah, so that should be cool, um, I'm not really expecting much from the service, but I've always been kind of interested in them. Just from a, a value perspective, I guess. I'd like to see, you know, what... I think it's like... Oh, fuck you! Okay, good. Um, I think it's like... Um, 30... I think it's 30 bucks for one month, and you might say, well, 30 bucks, fuck that! But, I mean, if you buy, you know, retro games, you know that, you know, you could, like I said, this game cost me 25 bucks. So, you know, you could drop 30 bucks on a single game. So, I don't know. It'll be interesting to see what they send me. I hope it's cool. If it is, I will, you know, recommend it for you guys and all that jazz. Shit, come on, man. Oh my god, that was the most health I've had. That was a stupid jump, but I made it anyways. Oh god. Come on, bounce me! Damn it. That's really unfortunate. I might cry. Alright, I got a few more tries left in me. What time is it? It's only 11. 11 and change. I've been having terrible sleep patterns lately, and like, last night I, f I fell asleep at 2. I woke up at 5.30, and then I was awake until 8.30, slept through my alarm, It just, I don't know what the fuck's going on with me. Bucky O'Hare? Yeah, I think it has some Bucky O'Hare in it. I haven't really spent much time with Bucky O'Hare, because... Price. <laughs> um... 
but I am familiar with the game. You know what game I think looks really cool? I want to pick up. I think I, I think it never came out. I could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure you gotta get it repro only. Um, that BioForce Ape game, and I actually found someone. Uh, I didn't go high enough. I don't think. Um, I found someone doing some really interesting NES hacks. Um, I'm gonna try to see if I can get some bro prices or discount or maybe a free copy. You know what I'm saying? Um, or, you know, I might just end up buying it anyways, but, um, dude, it's really interesting, uh, NES hacks, like, God of War and stuff, he basically takes games, um, he takes games that are similar to modern games and just gives them, like, some sort of modern spin, like, whether it be, you know, character sprites and, um, you know, new graphics and stuff like that, and, you know, new game small gameplay elements, but it looks really cool. I'm definitely, um, interested. If you, um, if you're subscribed to John Riggs, which you should be, because he's a fucking cool-ass dude, um, he just did a video for, um, what was it? I don't remember what it was called. But, uh, oh, um, um, Mr. Gimmick 2. And that game is made by the same company that's doing all these really... And the, the Freddy vs. Jason, I'm sure you guys have seen that hack uh, for NES. Like, they're doing some... The God of War? Like, I think like if I had a, a, a video titled God of War on the NES, like, I would get a shit ton of views. So, I almost want to just spend the 40 bucks or whatever it is to buy the repro. Just to try it out. You know, talk about the game a little bit. I think I'd have to get more repros before I could do that. Yo, why are you coming at me so hard, bruh? Fuck out of here. Woo! We beat him! Awesome. Very cool, very cool. Ooh, I could turn into a bat now. Let me do one more tweet, since we're making good progress here with the game. And it still is not putting the right information. Shoutouts to YouTube Gaming of Kid Dracula going on now. Kid Dracula. Still excited for the retro VGS. Oh god. Um it's tough. It's very tough to say. Um they did they've actually done I really need to cover that. I need more hours in the day. Um they did a teaser trailer that showed off some of the games. I think I've already covered all those games. But I mean, they really at $300, I need more than promises and, uh, one game. What the fuck is this? This game is so weird. I don't know what I'm doing. Um, I'm, st I'm still hopeful. I'm still optimistic. I'm not as excited as I once was, though. To be perfectly honest. Okay, that was smart. Um... And that's not to say the system's, you know, going to be bad or anything. I'm just not as excited as I once was. Is what it is. Ew, that's some nasty sprite flicker. Wow, I'm failing here. But yeah, the Kickstarters... I, re I really think that... Okay, so it's ice and you slide across it. That makes sense. I really think they should delay the Kickstarter. Delay it a month. You know, get your focus... And, um, you know, just know what you're doing. Like, they've added all those attachments, so now it'll play, um, other retro consoles. Like, okay, but, I mean, how many, how many of us, how many of the people that are going to be interested in the retro, or the retro VGS, don't already have that capability? Don't already have... A Retron 5 don't already have you know proper working systems already 
Like, it's it's a nice novelty to add that, but I just don't see um, the benefit. As I get, I guess as an all-in-one machine. Fuck. These little bastards are tricky. Um, as far as making it an all-in-one machine, that's cool, but that's not what I wanted the system to be. Initially, I thought so, Brazzle. I was hopefully optimistic. And I I guess I bought into the hype. But I, I think it still has an okay chance of doing something. But... Right. That's the, that's the biggest problem right now with the Retro VGS is the identity crisis. Everyone thought... I think even... I need to talk with my buddies. Because I, I, I know people like that are making games. Of course, you guys know what I'm talking about. That are making games for the platform. And we all initially thought that it was just going to be a system that would play, you know, Atari 2600 PS1 style games. Anything in between. And I figured that in order to make a claim like that, in order to... You know, what would be the point of, of investing money and time and effort into into creating something if you don't have software to back it up? So I was being naive and figured, oh, okay, well, they probably have all these games lined up. Because that's all that matters is the games. But I don't, I don't think they do. Shit, this is tough. And you should be skeptical. I mean, for 300 fucking dollars, I mean... You can pretty much buy an Xbox One for that. I saw an Xbox One uh, on my local uh, in a local Facebook group today, 275 with um, Unity, Arkham S or um, Assassin's Creed Unity. I of course have no interest in buying that right now, but um, still, like Jesus Lord, that was luck. They really should give me a heart. Yay! That's awesome. Um, I just have no interest in buying an Xbox One right now. But, I mean, I, I was, you know, kind of putting some money off to the side for the Retro VGS. But, you know, they who knows? They could impress with the Kickstarter. But I would say the Unity-based game should be left on the main gaming consoles. That should have stayed true to what it's supposed to be. Well, I mean, a game like Shovel Knight in a cartridge form for 20 25 bucks, 30 bucks, cool. Sign me the fuck up. You know what I'm saying? Like, high-quality retro-style games in... Oh, that's fuckery. In cartridge format? That's cool. I can get on board with that. But, like... You know... And the cartridges are going to be twenty to fifty dollars. Well, okay. Well, who determines the price? Does the developer determine the price? Does the does the retro VGS people determine the price? Is it determined on the quality of the game? Is it determined like there's so many question marks? And hopefully the Kickstarter will answer those. But um, I don't know. I'm just fucking up now. Oh, everyone left. Three people watching. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I think YouTube just randomly says there's less people watching because the service is still not 100% great. God! This might be our stopping point for the night. My frustration is setting in. I'm getting a wee bit tired. Okay. Take the hit. Start throwing these things. Hit him. Alright, cool. I wonder what you're really supposed to do. Yeah, YouTube just is like, oh, there's only two people watching. Okay. Shit. Alright, stupid snowman's about to come in. Ah, you bastard. Yeah, it says one person is watching right now. And there's three people talking. Stop trying the same thing over and over. I'm a creature of habit. For what? On this dude, I'll take the hit. I don't mind. Fuck. 
because those platforms sink. I guess I could turn into the... I mean, I would have to charge my shot. See, you, you slide. You slide off the damn thing. Like, I see, I see what you're saying. Like, I'll try it, but... I think it's easier said than done. Like, if I land here... See, he still ended up hitting me. Shit. Switch. Charge. Fly. Fly, you bastard! See? I'm better off just trying to... Trying it my way, I think. Fly! Helped a little, I guess. Three. Fell off. Fuck, man. No! <laughs> I don't like how it, it cycles back to the previous thing. It should just keep the last um, power up I used. This dude's a little fucker. Of course YouTube is fucking up. It's YouTube. What do you expect? No, I don't, I don't know what you mean by that. Ooh! Get on my level with that tech shit. You fucking snowman piece of fuck. Never trust a snowman. Alright. After this continue, I will try once more. I do have to get to bed at some point here. I'm about to sneeze. Achoo! Ugh, excuse me. No! Okay, we killed them both. Fuck you. Alright. You snowman bastard! Never trust a snowman! Bad Mr. Frosty. Clay Fighters. I want a new Clay Fighters. I feel like there should be a secret over here. Should have been like a heart or something. Alright. It'd be really nice if. A what the hell was that? fucking die right now. Where's the try shot? Okay. I need that in my life. It looks like you can, like, walk on those platforms, but you totally can't. Oh, a heart piece. Holy shit. Oh my god! Oh my god, that was fucking embarrassing. I can't believe that just happened. <laughs> That's funny, though. That's awesome! Oh my god. I think of that. <laughs> Fuck flying. Well, that's fine. I kind of wanted to die. Okay, so I got a plan now. That wasn't my last continue. This is my last continue. Shoutouts to YouTube for not fucking 
updating the name of the stream. Stupid fucking thing. Fall. All right, snowman fucker. Wow, just make, make moves. Fuck him. Asshole. Yeah, that was a fail. so dumb. I could just fly over these parts. <laughs> I love making games harder than they need to be. Fuck you! Two watching! Alright. You fucking piece of shit! And now you s give me a spawn here? Okay, that's different, but I'll take it. Yeah, you should pick it up, dude. It's a, it's a fun game. Instant spike death? Are you joking? Come on, dude. Some bullshit. I forgot to switch! God damn it. And at one hour exactly, well, 59 minutes, we're going to end the stream. Um, thank you for coming and hanging out. Um, Twas fun. Hope you guys enjoyed it and learned a little bit about a game that you might not have known about. I will be doing a review for it. Like I said, a quick review. Um, I don't really love this game. I don't really hate this game. So that's what the quick reviews are for. Um, but yeah. Thanks for hanging out. Um, I never know when I'm going to do these. Maybe I'll devise a schedule so maybe, you know, um, like it just won't be random. But I never know what the hell's going on with me. So, but yeah, thanks for checking the stream out. And I hope you enjoyed it. And I will see you guys next time. Later.